Hey guys, what's up? It's Apple Critics from AppleCritics.com. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the latest FaceTime feature that allows you to pause FaceTime on iOS 14. And I'm going to also show you some other changes on iOS 14. Uh, so what we can do is just enter into a FaceTime call. Now I can see that I'm currently on the FaceTime call. Uh, so what I can do is just simply uh, go out of the FaceTime call on my iPhone XS Max. So what I can do is just simply go out. And now you're going to see that it still shows me. So uh, it doesn't just pause anymore. So whatever I do, if I'm on my home screen, you can see it still shows me. So it doesn't show a pause screen. Now we do have that picture in picture so we can move it around and we can also move it to the side uh, so we have all of that so uh, that's good that we have this feature so what we can do is just actually uh, swipe it over and now you can see that my screen is still showing uh, me whatever I do uh, so this is super interesting and we just have the tab view so you can just swipe it over here uh, so what we can do is actually just go back into it uh, so that's just one of the new groundbreaking features of FaceTime on iOS 14. It's just the fact that you can still use it uh, and it doesn't uh, pause it anymore. Now, if you do want to pause the FaceTime on iOS 14, all you have to do is just simply swipe up. And then you just simply press on where it says camera off. And now if we go ahead and look at the FaceTime screen, you're going to see it will say pause for my camera. So uh, that is basically what you can do. So you have that feature right there. And then you'll just have your FaceTime pause and it won't continue to have the camera on. Uh, so that's a little bit of a hidden feature. So once again, if we turn the camera back on, we can just simply go out of the FaceTime app and then we can just uh, reply to text. And then we can just continue on uh, with using our device just like normal. And then we can just go back into the FaceTime just like that. So those are the options that we have uh, for FaceTime on iOS 14. So hopefully you enjoyed this video on the new FaceTime feature on iOS 14. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. Also be sure to smash that subscribe button as well. Also be sure to leave a comment down below of what you think of the new FaceTime on iOS 14. Be sure to subscribe for more great content. And also follow me on all the social media platforms with Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Uh, my username there is AppleCritics. And once again, thanks for watching.